All right, so for this Procreate tutorial, we're gonna learn how to cut an image, even if it's difficult, and a few tricks that you can do to try to cut an image out by itself with no background. So first thing I did was I imported an image. It's simply done by going to the wrench tool after you have your canvas made, insert a photo, and select the photo you want. So I'll cancel that. Okay, so one of the first things you can do is if you push down and select on the background to go white, then you can click the white tool here and drag and drop. And sometimes you might get lucky and then only have the image, sometimes you might not. This time it wouldn't work, but sometimes you can add in different places but it might end up changing the quality of the picture as you can see here. Because what it does is it takes the white and puts it into that exact um, shading or that exact uh, color. And so it's gonna overtake anything that might have that same shading or glaze over it. So this picture is horrible. So because of that, that glaze was over the top of the image and so the white also went over. Let's go back out. Also two fingers go back, three fingers forward. Okay, so instead, another example, the S or the cut tool, you gotta check down here, automatic, not color fill. Color fill will fill it with the color as you cut it. Okay, and then you're gonna come up here and you're gonna pull from left to right. If you pull too much, it's gonna pull the image. So you'll go back. So we got a pretty clean line here. Here, oh, nope. So you can click. So I'm not gonna click, instead I'm gonna pull. I'm gonna pull back, tell it to not go that much, but there's still some leftovers. Let's pull again, a little too much. Okay, I think we have a pretty nice cut for the most part. There's still some areas here, but we'll have to go back in manually and delete those. So then once you're happy with whatever you selected, three fingers down, and you can do a cut, which will just take it away completely. You can copy it, which will copy what you selected. Not the inner image, but the outside part. Duplicate, same thing. Cut and paste, it will cut the background out and then paste it. This is very helpful if you have a very large canvas or lots of layers because it won't, Procreate will boot you out. Um, this is just a trick that I've found. So I'm gonna do a cut and paste just to make sure. See how it, take it, it took it off? Well, we still have some leftovers. Um, so the next step would be to basically delete those um, from there. So we'll have to do that manually. So what I'm gonna do now is basically come here to the layers, the squares, deselect that so it's not showing. Come back into here and click the erase tool. And you're gonna to wanna to use a, if you use a soft brush, you can get close to the edges. Um, but when you get close to the edges, it's not gonna create a very solid crisp line that's gonna have kind of a fade. Um, so you, what I do is I use a hard airbrush. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna zoom in. And I'm gonna take this brush and I'm gonna go right along the edges like so. And when some of the edges are gonna be curved. So let me find it, so like this one here. So you could take your eraser and go around like this and then stop and it's gonna pull it as an exact nice round shape. So you can kind of cheat like that. And then you're just gonna come back in and do the rest. So you'll do that and then once you're completed with it, you'll have your image by itself. And then when you save it, Make sure to take the background out, 
That way you don't have to do it again.